what is going on guys how you all doing happy friday just wanted to uh share my my beauty here as you know it this is the unboxing that we did earlier and i've got it all set up now it is obviously empty I'm just gonna move these empty uh mags over here well we'll say clips to be politically correct. We'll set the clips out of there. Um, so this rifle is a DPMS Panther Arms AR-10, 16 inch barrel. Um, it's about an entire inch shorter than a typical AR in this platform so that makes it really nice you've got the uh, free floating barrel handguard uh, gas gas impingement system this does have mag pull uh, M bus sights on there they can go down just like that and if you prefer to have them that way and just run whatever optic you run I just keep them up in case there, something ever happens I can co-witness. Um, these are polymer, really tough. They'll withstand a lot of beating. So we got the uh, Magpul M-Bus on there. Magpul adjustable stock. Over here. Six position adjustable. Then we have a uh, bipod over here. It's also adjustable. You can drop them screws down, and flip it around, and adjust it. And or if you want, you can flip them up and get them out of the way, and you know shoot with uh, with the. Uh, bipod out the way or you can take it off if you prefer um, for fun shooting you know it's not a big deal to hold it up if I'm doing uh, precision shooting I'm gonna use a bipod anyway so it's on there for me I also have a EOTech um, holographic optic on here um, that's about the best you can get um, this is the green, uh, green laser version, if you will. So your, your image is green instead of red. I prefer the green. I think it's easier to see. I've also got rid of the flash suppressor that came on their stock, um, because I do not have a suppressor for it, but it does come with the ACC uh flash suppressor if that's your thing but since i don't shoot this at a range and i don't have a suppressor for it i put a muzzle brake on so we have a um muzzle brake right there I'll give you an image of that that's the muzzle brake it does have the clip that's in there now um I have three 20 rounders and it uh, also you can get 30 rounds if you want or you can put a 50 round drum clip on there if you if you want to do that um, so that's the new baby now obviously you see a little bit of a uh, uh, black right there I've got to clean that up um, to get that old uh, flash suppressor off you I mean I had to heat that thing up to probably uh, 1500 degrees to break the rock set off um, and then I just uh, put red Loctite on that. Um, would not use blue. They both have a 300 degree uh, heat threshold. You really, you probably won't ever see that unless you're doing major rapid fire. Um, I guess you could, but uh, I probably won't ever see that. So we'll get that all cleaned up in that. What else do I have that's going to be on this? Well, I am going to put a um, 
I've got a, uh, what do you call it, uh, three times uh, EOTech magnifier that's going to go right here. Um, and this red dot will just slide up just a little bit onto the uh, hand guard and then the magnifier will go behind it. So one time magnification as is and then basically I have four times magnification. So um, with this uh, one dot or this holographic site right now, it's a 68 MOA uh, or a minute of angle large circle with a one MOA uh, precision circle and at a hundred yards it's uh, accurate to within a half inch um, being sighted in and you could probably reach out with this uh, specific red dot without a magnification on it you, you could I could see doing two to three hundred yards easy anything beyond that uh, you'll need the magnification uh, scope for that or put a scope on it whatever you prefer and then uh, this rifle will get you out probably about uh, with a 16 inch barrel you're probably looking at about six to seven hundred yards um, pretty accurate now obviously if you put a longer barrel on um, you know 800 to a thousand would be no problem for a 308 um, I would probably opt to have a uh, 300 Win Mag or 338 Lapua. That's coming soon. <laughs> um, but I did want to share this with you. Um, if you're interested in this uh, particular firearm, um, I got this at Bud's Gun Shop. And it came in tax tagged and shipped to me right around uh, 1200 bucks. So not too bad. So I'll, let you, uh, I'll give you a close up of it right quick. Again, you have the muzzle brake, Magpul M bus, you have the quad rail on the handguard, free floating barrel, bipod, EOTech, uh, holographic, Magpul stock. Flip it over here for you. And give you a look from the other side. And there you have it, guys. And we'll be uh, getting all this fun stuff uh, tomorrow. We'll be doing some uh, shooting videos with this, so stay tuned. If you have any questions at all, guys, put them in the comments below. I am eager to answer your questions and uh, I will be more than happy to. Um, if you want to know any specifications in that, uh, just put them in the comments and I will answer you. I can't really link anything to it because it's a firearm and you know, that's a no-no on YouTube, but I'd be more than happy to share any information with you. Thank you for watching, thank you for being the best part of this channel, and I can't wait to talk to y'all. Y'all have a good one.